around here, and I think the uh, number six car is going to be in the Catbird seat. Oh, oh! we've got contact there. That was Ouch. between two of the Porsches. It looks like that's the number 48 Porsche. Wow. That's a GT car together with the car. Oh, the huge crash with Enrique Cisneros and or, or Eduardo Cisneros in the number 31 car. See the two be on cars the right side, side of the screen. By side they come together and they have so much momentum. They literally just go straight off. And there you see him kind of hit that little section. He gets a dip and he's bouncing along the wall. He doesn't just hit the wall and flip onto it. He is bouncing along that tire barrier. Wow. And that's right over the top of the marshal's post as well. That was absolutely terrifying. And and that's one of our camera guys. Rich White, you see him at the camera where it says TV crew. We understand he's okay. That's a great sign. See him standing with this camera, never flinching. Rich White does an incredible job of following that. But in the meantime, there you see the, him moving off to the side. Everybody concerned. The tire marshals there as well. This was the angle from Rich's camera as he sees the car literally coming at him and colliding with the tires directly in front of them. Meanwhile, you had that course marshal, that little uh, uh, area right there, and they were getting out of the way. And it's important to point out, this car does land straight up. And this is the onboard of Cisneros's car. And obviously, we lose it just as he starts to go through. That was a very frightening accident. You could see the marshal's point there. And there we see the driver, Enrique Cisnero, wow. or Eduardo Cisneros, getting out of the car. That is a great sight to see. What an incredible shunt as the two came together. He hit the wall, flipped up over, and actually did a complete flip. And now you can see him pointing over to the other Porsche, the one being driven by Marco Holt. So thank you for the thumbs up. We appreciate that. And he's looking over at him going, what? What yeah. was going on there? Yeah, and uh, th that car, the number 31 car, was leading the class after a great first hit by Kuba Gimeziak. There's Enrique Cisneros, who is Eduardo's younger brother. And uh, you can see the emotion down there in the pit lane. You know, great to see that the uh, double thumbs up there because that was a very frightening accident indeed. You can see the car has ended up on top of the tire barrier. Just remarkable. That's a hugely scary moment because you saw the contact. You knew they were going in very hard, but you and then you saw the car manage to land completely flip and but with the roof slightly caved in. Rich White. It is amazing. He not only stays with his camera, he stays with the action. Watch as he turns and follows the car as it's going along, unaware, of course, that the Cisneros car is coming his way. He leaves the camera and dives off to the side, and he's pointing to these guys off to the side saying, you okay? You okay? If you're okay, I'm heading back to the camera. And then he's going to go back over here and make sure that the drivers are okay, of course, after he gets his cat. Well, yeah, he has to listen to, to his producer down there to make sure. <laughs> Goodness gracious me. That is amazing. Rich, I got to give you credit to be able to not just have the, the wherewithal to stick with it, but to stay through all that. And more importantly, we have to be so thankful that Cisneros is okay, despite the tremendous impact where he flips over onto that tire barrier, gets out of the car, and he's okay. And it is a true testament yeah. to these cars. I mean, when you think about it, this GTC car is a production yeah based car. Yes, it has a roll cage. Yes, it has strengthening, but this is a production based car.